y'all, I just delivered my first load. And it is freaking roaches everywhere coming out. Like, what the freak is going on? Like, these are roaches that I just killed. They was not visible when I first got this truck. What the freak? Well, I'm about to lose my freaking mind. Dog, it is roaches everywhere in this freaking truck. Like, what the heck? I, I've i never experienced nothing like this. Like, I've heard stories. Bro, I'm so fucking scared to go to sleep. Like, one roach was just in the bed. And every time I cut off the freaking light and turn the light back on, they come out. One was just crawling in here. It ain't even no food in here. This stuff ain't even. Oh, look, ants right there. This brand new hot sauce not open. Brand new relish not even open. A red bull. None of this stuff ain't even open. There's no food in here. Another one. This is freaking ridiculous. The fuck? Don't make no fucking sense, man. Can't even go to sleep. This is not funny, Smooth. Dang, bro. No, but for real, you know how many times I got up playing light games with these freaking roaches? I laid down for two minutes, and I know as soon as the light comes, as soon as I turn the light off, they're gonna freaking come out. And every time I turn the light off, lay down, and I can't sleep, especially after the two that was in the freaking bed. Yeah, you I'll sitting there laughing stuff. like this funny. <laughs> it's not funny, I'm just saying. It's how you said it. You know how many times I had to wake up and play light games with you? For real, playing light games. I'm glad this funny to you because I'm very angry, dog. <laughs> I know, man. Trust me, I would have been angry too. Getting a fresh, supposedly fresh truck in. Got to deal with that. Whoever had the truck, they not, like they left that truck nasty. They had to, cause how? Like, if anybody else was in this truck, that mean these roaches been in here. There's too many of them. That don't make no sense. Last night I killed twenty roaches, dog. I swear to God, probably more than that. Twenty roaches. That's bad. Look, 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 right here by the, what the freak? You telling me to look like I can see, I can't see. It's right here by the headboard. What the, f dog, I swear to God. What a shit, and I can't get my damn shoe fast enough. Imagine if I'm here asleep. Man. Where the hell it went at? Dog, I'm fucking angry. I'm not, I can't. I cannot. I can't. After I deliver this load, I can't. I'm sorry, like this is dangerous. It's like, shit, the first day you was in there, it was like you see one, two, three, maybe in there, but now you see them back to back here waking up now. They looking for their fucking cousins that I done killed.
dog. I swear to God, I'm about to cry. Oh my God. Look, just look at this. Look at this. Dog, look at this. This is fucking. Yeah, he told I gotta move slow. The fuck? Had to get my flashlight and see if I got it. Let's see. Yep, it's dead. This is fucking ridiculous, man. Got it. This is ridiculous, dog. Look at this. I don't even know if the shit pregnant or not, but this is a big damn roach. Bro, look at this shit. On the fucking bed, dog. I cannot fucking sleep. I cannot sleep. I cannot fucking sleep, dog. The shit done ran back down there. I'm fucking aggravated. Very fucking aggravated. Very fucking pissed off. Like, this shit just really pissed me the fuck off. I've never experienced no shit like this. Y'all, I've been on duty for four hours and 36 minutes. I still have not went to sleep. It is, what time is it? 3.55 in the morning. And I cannot freaking sleep. I am not going to be able to go to sleep. So. I wrote dispatch again. A whole fucking roast just crawled up in the bed with me. Like. I can't. So what I'm finna do is. I'm just finna. I'm gonna sleep in the front seat because. I, I just can't. I'm gonna go ahead. Where my pillow? Go ahead, put my pillow on the front seat, and I'm just gonna sleep in the front seat because I'm sleepy. I'm very sleepy, and I I just picked up this load, and I don't even think I'm gonna deliver it because this is dangerous. This is very dangerous. I can be driving, and something could be crawling on me. And what if I freak out and I wreck or something? Like, no. I'm not sleeping back there. I don't even know if there's roaches up here because I I seen them crawling on the floor, but I haven't seen them like up here on the dash or anything like that. They're basically back there in the bunk, which means whichever nasty fat fucker that had this truck before me was a fucking pig. Excuse my French, but I am very much pissed. I'll let you guys know what happened tomorrow when my dispatch get in. But right now, like, I'm not in the mood. Especially with this being the resolution. Having a seat in the front seat. All right, y'all. So, we is about to bomb the truck. Um, My dispatch pretty much told me that um, no trucks. No extra trucks for me to get. So, I'm stuck in this truck. Um, so, all well, right, now we're gonna bomb the truck. Y'all see smoothies in town? Uh -huh. <laughs> going on, love, but he made it down. So, we is about to bomb the truck and try to get these roaches out of here because I cannot drive like this. It's hot, yeah, it's real hot. So, we about to go ahead and get busy. Uh, I'll show you guys the kind of um foggers that I purchased, and he also purchased some um, what, what is that like gel. Like roach yeah, bait gel. It's basically got it's got peanut butter in it. It's attractive. So once one one of them eat it, they touch another one, and they touch another one, all of them, whatever they touch is gonna die. So then if they go back to the nest, you know, all of them. Go back. It works though. I had got a car at the auction, full of full of roaches, like everywhere, and I dropped that thing in there, left the car closed for like a day or two, 
all of them was on their back. What yeah. it was? Yeah, they was on their back. They was on their back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I hope they be on their back in here, cause baby, if not, they ass gonna be on their on their hands and their feet once I smash them, cause they gotta go. But um. Then I gotta hook that blow up, to blow up all this stuff. Up yeah, so that's just how my weekend coming along. This is what we doing. Well, let's just go ahead and get ready. How long do we all let this stuff sit? Like three, four hours. That's what we. I've doing. never experienced this. I'm I'm from the hood, y'all. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Front of projects, I've seen roaches the same. But I've never had nothing in my home. I've never lived with roaches in my home like that as an adult. My adult life, I've never went through this. So this is new to me. And yeah, it's causing my allergies. I'm over here blowing the hell out of my nose. Nah, like I said, I, I experienced it in these type of roaches. These are the hardest roaches to get rid of. The That's ones I got? Yes, hardest roaches to get rid of. Then they had the German roaches, the little small roaches. Them the hardest ones to it's get rid of. It's two kind of here. I seen some that's little and black, and then you got the no, brown them ones. the babies. Oh, them the babies? Yeah. And then once they get older, they can turn brown? Yeah. Oh, wow. So they done had kids in here. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, no, I ain't. They in here getting busy, making families and stuff, but shit. They gonna die because that stuff right there, they hungry, they gonna eat it. When they eat it, they gonna go somewhere else. Even if they don't go, once they eat it, they dead. It's boric acid. So once they get in their system, they start eating it away. Okay. All right, y'all. So that's the plan. But then again, I was kind of angry, like very, very angry. But I can't really be mad at my company because they can't control drivers and the things that they do inside of the trucks. Like... If you got a nasty driver and they've been running in this truck for a whole year, two years, however long they've been with the company with the same truck, we don't know how they're living inside of the truck. So I can't even get mad at the people that cleaned out the truck. Because remember I was telling you about it and you was like, well, the people that cleaned the truck probably should have seen it. I didn't even see it when I first came in the truck. Because if I would have seen roaches then, I wouldn't even brought my things in from the beginning. So they was hiding when I came. And then once I got my things in the truck is when, you know, one or two started popping out. I guess they was trying to come and introduce themselves, and mm -hmm. then the rest of the family just started popping up. So I really can't even get mad and say yeah, it that. Don't, it don't look like, yeah, that's why I'm still just around here looking around. It don't, you can't just tell off that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So, and then that's another thing, like if you become an owner rapper and you purchase a truck, you can't just go take the truck back because it got roaches once you don't board it. You just got to bomb it and get them out, so. I mean, it's not a big, big deal because I'm going to get them out. They going to they gonna die. Another, so, but I'm just saying, it's like, is the water safe to keep in here? Like, this water is fine. Yeah, the water closed up. Okay. Only thing is, like, your personal stuff that you're gonna constantly touch, like, uh, put in your mouth or spoons. Uh, spoons closed up, right? Oh well, yeah, no, the oh, box no, of take spoons. them out. They in the box. They in the, and they have an opening in there. Yeah. So spoons, I can take the spoons and Anything that out. you like was gonna use, and you gotta touch up, touch it, and put it in your mouth or anything like that. Check it out. But anything else that's sealed up and closed, don't worry about it. Once you clean and wipe down everything, it should be straight. Yeah, it does. He done opened the back door. I don't know if you guys have ever seen the back door of a semi open. This is my first time. Yeah. He done opened the back window to get some breeze. So, man, I used that to. It definitely does open. Some people actually sleep like at the truck Look. stop. And they don't want to run their truck and they want to just a nice if it's a nice you in somewhere where it's cool and the weather nice look i used to have my windows you can do cracked, that this open and i park all the way at the back and i make sure i park on the edge where well, this is just nothing but uh trees and stuff mm -hmm. and i used to be sitting right here and smoking my vape and be just out there vibing have my tv on flip this way be watching the tv while i'm looking out there and just chilling you gotta know how to relax out here, clear your mind. Like that mental stuff you been talking about, your mental state. You gotta keep it clear. All right, guys, we got no mess dry fogger. So basically, this is not gonna leave the windows all sticky and your clothes or the seats and everything that you touched. Because some of them do leave like a little uh, film. 
over everything because it's gonna sit in here. So this, you know, I got three. I'm gonna put one under the bed, two in the cab. This is basically for if the roaches are sitting outside of the truck and happens to come back in, this is gonna be waiting for them. So this is a gel that, um, it's like peanut butter, but uh, it has uh, boric acid, it has all type of stuff to kill them. So once they eat it, on the back you can see, it's gonna trail and they go to the nest and it's gonna kill everybody, whoever left over. So you just put this in all type of little secret spots, everywhere, little crevices. I'm gonna pop some of this uh, plastic off, put it behind it because some of them could be hiding behind the dashboard or anything like that. Then I got her this just in case they come just one straggler left around you know hit them with some of this and then she should be good but i think with just those two she should be good and um go watch me do it That. You even gotta do too much, just put let me pop up this so you can see. Remember, if you touch this on your hand, make sure you wipe your hands and not put this back in your mouth because it's not going to taste good for one and you're going to be sick. Let me get this out. All right. With this one, you're going to need some water. Not that much. It gives you a line where to fill it. So once you take this off, I got to hurry up because those two in there, take this can out. Fill it up to about there with water. Put a little bit too much, that's cool. And then, uh, should I do it on the other side? Yeah. yeah we got more space. Take that bottle of water out. All right, y'all. We done made it back to the truck over here. We about to go in there and see if Gotta go see if we find some little roaches on their backs right now, man. Hopefully, what y'all didn't know, I set off those bombs. I went inside there thinking, you know what I'm saying, they were gonna be gone. Those three bombs. And I sat in the dang on driver's seat. It was one right there in the back throwing up gang signs to me. I said, oh, Lord. So I went back to Home Depot. I grabbed some bigger ones. And I set off three, three different times. We haven't checked the truck since last night. I let it sit all overnight. And I bought some little roach motels. I'm supposed to kill them. You bought supposed the motel? To, yeah, I bought them a hotel. And um, now we're about to go check on the truck. So y'all get the first look just like we is. So. Hello, stay tuned. Oh, I forgot your key. You don't got the truck key? Smell. Oh, don't know three you let off. Oh. <laughs> Why you wanna play? <laughs> Come on, man. I hope they did stop playing because you wanna play on my legs like something crawling on me. Oh, you put a hotel right there. Right here, bitch. On the back. Where? Right here. Twitching still. 
Sam. Okay, mm -hmm. see? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh oh. Okay, we got one. He fight for his life. See that, see that up there? He got drunk last night. Alright y'all, so now I'm just about to take all my things out. I'm about to take all my stuff out. Even though I just threw it up there because I was switching in this truck. I'm about to take all that out and we're about to go to the wash house and I'm going to wash it. And I'm pretty much going to end the vlog here. If we get any more roaches or if I see any more roaches coming out, I'll definitely keep you guys updated. And then I'm definitely going to just... Um, demand to have another truck but hopefully this works and we can get back rolling and back to the money um comment down below let me know if you guys ever experienced this uh, have you ever had a truck from somebody um another company and you've had rodents roaches or foul odor smoking rodents i'm sorry rodents um foul odor um pet hair it's a lot of things that come with you know getting a truck from companies because not all the time you get lucky and get a brand new truck you're not always the first driver of the truck like somebody has always has already been in there before you so um like i said comment down below let me know if you dealt with either a situation like this or similar how did you handle it um did you try to fix it yourself and keep rolling or did you just you know put your foot down and tell them that you ain't rolling like that but, like I said, we about to end the vlog here. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. As always, I'll see you guys in my very next video. Bye.